hello student welcome to this video this is lecture number 50 already 49 lecture covered the solid the supplementary problem of vector analysis book by MRS Pajal you all know this book is very important for BSc physics as well as for mathematics and this is important for IIT jam preparation that's why we decide to solve the supplementary problem of this book in this video you want to solve the supplementary problem 5.62 to 5.64 of chapter 5 which consists vector analysis sorry vector integration so let's start with question number 5.62 which says if suppose a vector is this given uh, find out this surface integral over the entire surface region above the xy plane bounded by this cone z square equal to x square plus y square and z equal to 4 plane if you want to draw this cone uh, in the xy plane so this is x axis if this is y axis and this is z axis then the cone will be like that okay this is the cone which can be found by this where here the z is 4 okay so for that you need to find out the n cap at first so you know n cap is nothing but grad phi by grad phi mod right so what is the grad phi grad phi where phi is the phi is the nothing but x square plus y square minus z square so grad phi is nothing but 2 x i cap and 2 y j cap minus 2 z k cap and the magnitude of the grad phi is 4 x square plus 4 y square plus 4 z square if we come on this four these two are cancel out so x i cap y j cap minus z k cap divided by root under 4 x square plus y square x square plus y square z square z square z square that is 2 z square so this can be written as 1 by root 2 z within bracket x i cap plus y j cap minus z k cap this is the uh, n cap n cap is the normal vector of the surface now want to find out the a dot n cap okay so if you dot this with respect to a vector with n cap so you will be get 1 by root 2 z within better x is multiplied with that that is 4 x square z y is multiplied with that this is x y square z square and z is multiplied with this this will be minus 3 z square okay so this is a dot n and this z is cancel out so this will becomes 1 by root 2 4 x square plus x y square z minus 3 z now if you uh, want to find out this integration a dot n cap ds so a dot n cap is nothing but 1 by root 2 4 x square plus x y square z minus 3 z this is a dot n cap and ds ds is if you write this as the dy dz by i cap dot n cap mod so this become 1 by root 2 4 x square plus x y square z minus 3 z d y dz this become d y dz and the i cap dot n cap will give you x by z 1 by root 2 x by z right x by z so this will becomes z will be multiplied here and x will be divided so this will be gives you z will multiply and x divided so this will give you 4 x z plus y square z square minus 3 z by x into dy dz now okay 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 4x z y square region minus 3z 
this z will become here so this will be z square 3z square x dy dz so this is 4xz just wants to replace of x so this is 4z x is nothing but z square minus y square plus y square z square minus <coughs> y square z square minus 3z square by root under z square y square dy dz right so <coughs> just integrate with respect to y so this will becomes 4z 4z integration of this is nothing but y by 2 root under z square minus y square plus z square by 2 sin inverse y by z and with respect to y this will becomes y q by 3 z square with respect to y this is 3 z square this is the square j square into sin inverse y by z the value of y is minus z2 plus z and it is dz so if we put z minus z plus z this will become zero if we put here this is 4z into z square by 2 sin inverse 1 is pi by 2 minus of sin inverse minus 1 minus pi by 2 so this becomes pi and this is z square by 3 this is z cube z cube so this is 2 z cube minus of this comes into positive and in this 3 z square this will also pi by 2 plus pi by 2 that into dz so this is uh, this is pi and these two are multiplied so this is 2 pi this is z cube so integration will be z to the power 4 by 4 plus this is z to the power 4 by 4 this becomes 12 so sorry sorry this is 2 5 so this will be 6 here is 2 3 6 by 6 minus 3 z q by 3 and this is pi and the limit of the z is nothing but 0 to 4 so if you put 0 this is 0 if you put 4 this is 4 to the power 4 so this is 2 pi 4 q is 64 and this is 4 to the power so this two are cancelled out 1 by 9 4 to the power 6 minus 3 3 cancel out pi 4 to the power q so this become 4 q is 64 64 so this is 64 pi and this become 4 to the power 6 4 q is 64 into 64 this is 25 4 4 16 1 25 and 24 2 38 6 9 4 4 0 9 6 by 9 like that okay mm -hmm. so this is the answer of this question go to the next one 5.63 says they let the r is the projection of surface s prove that s is given by this so the area area you know this is ds so this can be written as this can be written as if you take dx dy then the surface integral will be n cap dot k cap mod and you know 
the value of n cap what is the value of n cap this here the z is nothing but f of x y so the phi is nothing but z minus f of x y phi minus f of x y so grad phi grad phi is nothing but if we derivative with respect to x so this will be del f del x i cap minus del f del y j cap and with respect to z so this is will be plus k cap so n cap grad phi mod is nothing but root under this is 1 so 1 plus del f del x whole square del f del y whole square so n cap will be grad phi by grad phi mod so if you dot with k cap n cap dot k cap so this will be 1 and in the denominator this will be n dot k cap this will be denominator 1 plus del f del x whole square plus del f del y whole square okay so n cap dot del is this so this will becomes in the upper side so you will be get root under 1 plus del f del x whole square del f del y whole square dx dy okay so this is the proof go to the next one here the f function is given as this so phi is nothing but f x y z right so grad phi is nothing but So grad phi is nothing but del f del x i cap plus del f del y j cap plus del f del z k cap grad phi mod t plus is nothing but root under del f del x whole square plus del f del y whole square plus del f del z whole square so what is the value of n cap that is grad phi by grad phi mod and the integration if we take the integration ds along the x y direction so if we take along x to y direction so you need to dot with n k cap which is perpendicular in direction to the x y plane so if we dot with this n cap dot k cap n cap dot k cap we will get del f del z del capital f del f del z by root under del f del x whole square plus del f del y whole square plus del f del z whole square so this is becomes if we multiply here so this becomes in the upper side so this is nothing but root under del f del x whole square plus del f del y whole square del f del z whole square by del f del z right that into dx dy dx dy okay so this is the solution of this question go to the next one 5.64 a for a the uh, surface is cut by the x equal to 0 y equal to 0 x so here the phi is nothing but x plus 2 y plus 2 z minus 12 so grad phi will be this is i cap plus 2 j cap plus 2 k cap so mode of grad phi is nothing but root under 1 plus 2 square 4 plus 2 square 4 this will be root 9 that is 3 so n cap is nothing but grad phi by grad phi mod so this is nothing but one third uh, i cap plus 2 j cap plus 2 k cap this is the value of this n cap 
right so the integration surface integral surface integral means ds okay so this can be written as dx dy by n cap dot k cap mode so this is nothing but dx dy if we take n cap dot k cap so this will becomes two third so this is three by two and the three by two and the limit of x is come zero to one dx and also the limit of y is also zero to one dy so this is nothing but x so this is three by two x and limit will be one why this limit will be one so the answer of this question is three by two go to the next question here the limit will be changes the this form is are same so in the up to this this will be same the limit will be changes so i can write here integration um, two third right this is two third three by two this is three by two dx dy here the x changes from x square equal to 16 minus y square so x changes from here the x changes from minus root under 16 minus y square to plus root 16 minus y square right and the y changes sorry 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 x there is no zero a no negative mark so the x change to zero to a and y change to zero to four so you can write this is three by two and x equals to zero to root under 16 minus y square dx and dy so if you take integration this will be x so this is become 16 minus y square dy limit of dy is 0 to 4 so this is 3 by 2 integration of this this is y by 2 root under 16 minus y square plus 16 by 2 sine inverse y by 4 0 to 4 put here 0 this will be 0 if you put 4 this will be just so this term is 0 for 2 limits and for 0 this will be 0 for 4 this will be 4 sine inverse 1 this is pi by 2 3 3 2 2 2 this become 6 pi so this is the answer of this question thank you this is all about me this is my contact details you can contact with me by whatsapp or telegram channel for any query regarding physics and this is my youtube channel details go to this channel you can get all the video which already uploaded subscribe to this channel if you new in this channel and those who already subscribe thank you for subscription and press the bell icon to get the notification when i will be uploaded new video and share this video to your friends so that he or she also can get benefit from this video Take care. We will meet in the next video as soon as possible.